Hi everyone, I'm coming on quickly to make the fastest tassel you will ever see. It is using fringe trim. Okay. Now, I take the gold beads off it, but I'm not going to do that for this video. I just want it to be quite quick so you can see it. So I'm just going to snip a little bit off. Now, depending on how thick or how thin you want your tassel will depend on how much trim you use. But I think this is wide enough, so that's what, let me see, I'll measure it for you. It's about three and a half. Okay. And I think that's a perfect amount for the tassel. Now, all you do is add tiny wee bit of hot glue along the top here, okay? And then you just fold that part in, fold it in again, and then you have got enough there to actually just do it in hand now, without burning yourself. And that's all you're doing is just rolling it in. Another wee bit of hot glue. And just wrap your trim on. Okay. Another wee bit of hot glue. Wrap your trim. On. Again, some more hot glue. <coughs> Wrap your trim on. And then lastly, your last little bit. Wrap it on. And you end up with a tassel. Now, you can easily thread this together. So I'm just going to show you what I do to thread it on. I pull out one of the trims. Do it that way. Now this is just for speed I'm doing it this way. Take my pokey tool, make sure I've got a little bit of space there for it to go through, like that, okay, then I use needle so I can find my stickish needle here thread on my trim but you could just braid um what do you call it um do -do -do, try and think can baker's twine Hemp cord thread, as long as it's quite thick, you could use just a bit of anything. Oops, let me see, I've made a muckery of that. Let's mm -hmm. tie a knot on the top of it. Come on, behave. Tie a knot. Tie another knot just to make sure it's not going to pop out over the top of it. Snip the excess away. Add in a wee bit of hot glue so that's not going to fray on me. 
Ideally, I would have left a little bit more on this part, but it's just to show you how to do it. <coughs> Take my pocket tool out because I know now where I'm roughly going. Thread your needle through, pull it up, and then all you're doing is just snipping where your needles come out. Tie we know it. Tie another we know it. And you have got now something to add your tassel on with. So I hope you've enjoyed that. I hope that you have a wee go at it. Pull out your fringing tassel trim and have a go at making your own tassels. Super simple, super easy and look how effective they are on your projects. Really simple. Absolutely love them. So, thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Speak to you all soon. Bye for now.